back in March 2022, AdSense Match content was replaced by Multiplex ads. The primary difference between these two ad types is that Multiplex ads are configured to only show ads, while Match content was designed to allow publishers to show a mixture of ads and content recommendations from the site to encourage prolonged user engagement. Multiplex ads are a form of the highly effective native ad format that can serve multiple ads in a grid within just a single ad unit. It is usually found right around the end of blog posts or articles or in the sidebar section in a desktop layout. This helps in improving monetization at the end of a user's browsing experience on a particular page or section of the site by showing these users a set of ads right after they finish going through the page's content or before they make the decision to leave the site and finish that user's session. Many third-party native ad providers have exclusivity clauses and the settings can be quite restrictive. With AdSense Multiplex ads, however, publishers can customize and set the ad style to blend in well with the site's layout and look. To create a multiplex ad in AdSense, go to Ads, select by ad unit, and select Multiplex ads. Give your multiplex ad unit a descriptive name, for example, indicate the site where this ad unit will show, along with the position on the website where this will show up. In the ad size section, choose the size that will fit the layout where this ad will appear. Google recommends choosing responsive, which will allow the multiplex ad to adapt how it's served depending on the screen size, whether it's on mobile, desktop, or tablet, and the width of the ad container. To check how the ad will render on different layouts, use the preview feature. If you prefer to have fixed or custom sizes, it is recommended that you choose an ad size with a width to height ratio of around 2 to 1 for a horizontal layout or 1 to 2 for a vertical layout. Don't use traditional display sizes such as 728 by 90 for multiplex ads. Neither the height nor the width of the ad should exceed 1200 pixels and only one dimension can be greater than 600 pixels. Next, go to Add Style and configure your preferred fonts and colors to match the look and feel of your website. After clicking on Create, you will be shown a piece of code that you can place into the HTML source code of the pages on your website where you want the multiplex ads to show. When using WordPress, you can use plugins like Advanced Ads or Ad Inserter to insert the ad code to your site and configure the position where it will show up. Make sure to test and review how the ad is rendering after adding the code on your website and make the necessary adjustments to the multiplex ad style and settings if needed. Thanks for joining us today. We hope you enjoyed our presentation. Also, learn to monetize more by watching our tutorial series and reading our latest ad optimization tip. Please subscribe to our blog to receive periodic updates. Thanks. We'll catch you next time.